What's up, guys? Welcome to the Steve Bisogany Show. Today's got a good topic, uh, as it always is. Uh, video text messaging and video messaging and, and video overall as a whole is becoming a huge part of the industry of marketing. And, you know, we as real estate agents, we are marketers. So um, one of the things that we need to focus on as marketers is uh, to be better real estate agents. I do apologize, though. My dog is underneath my desk right now. He is munching hardcore on this bone, and he is... Um, just making a lot of noise. So I apologize for the grinding underneath my desk. Um, so, um, so yeah, so video is like the new way to go. So right now, um, a lot of people and you know, a couple things. One, people say, you know, a picture is worth a 1000 words. Well, I've heard a couple things regarding video video, they say if a picture is worth a 1000 words, then video is worth 1.8 million. Okay, well, I'll take 1.8 million words versus a thousand or just one. So I'm going video on this one. Uh, second, I've also heard that uh, something like something along the lines of uh, 10 seconds of video is worth a million words. I'm like, okay, still, I'm going video here. What, here's why that's true. 90, over 90% of communication is body language. So if I, if you could see and hear and feel me, like, then it's way more important than, um, Actually, probably not the feel part because it is video, so we're not actually touching, but physically. But like, if you can see and hear me, and you can walk, look at my body language, you can see that I'm smiling. You can see that I have uh, enthusiasm. You can he- not only not just hear my voice in like a podcast, or you, it's not like you're just reading words on a on a screen. I mean, geez, how many times do we have uh, text message conversations with our significant others where we send a text message? It's meant to be funny and. You know, for me and my wife, I send her a text message that's supposed to be funny and make her laugh. And she goes, I can't believe you just said that. You're such a jerk. I'm like, well, that didn't turn out right. Now, however, if I had sent a video text message of me saying whatever I said, she would have been able to see me smiling. She would have said, see all the body language. She would have felt, uh, heard the inflection in my voice. And she would have knew right away um, that that was not a malicious comment at all. But, you know, just text on a page doesn't always get the job done. You need to have that. There's, you're basically getting rid of 90% of the communication by not having video in your, in your uh, communication. So uh, you got to, guys, as real estate agents, we've got to have more uh, video in our communications. Um, and here, my God, my dog is really getting after this bone. Can you just wait for just a second until I can finish this <laughs> video first? Um, geez. <laughs> So, so sorry, guys. All right. So um, the, here's the thing. So a lot of people, what I talk to, they're like, ah, dude, you know, I just feel so weird. Like, I feel like such a, uh, like, because the word influencer is such, got a, it has a negative connotation with it. Um, and the word, uh, w- I guess you never want to be that, you don't want to be that stereotypical millennial that just like, you know, oh my God, I'm holding this, you know, hold, like looking like, you know, with the duck face and, you know, you don't want to be that person and you don't have to be. That's the beauty of it. Like, you know, what I, I'm friends with quite a number of influencers on uh, social media, and the number one way to insult them is call them T and A. I'm not going to explain what those letters mean. I'm sure you can probably figure them out on your own, um, but that's an insult to an influencer. But just, and you know the you know the people who are just you know taking pictures of themselves and you know go on a profile and every picture is only of them. That's that's you know, and they're not providing any value other than their physical appearance. If you guys get where I'm going with that, um, that's um, that's not the kind of influencer I'm talking about. You can give value and give good information and give you know community information and be an influencer by just being yourself. People, I mean, let's put it this way: people already like you for who you are. I mean, you're you're just recording it now. That's that's the only difference. And some people are like, uh, you know, I've talked to a guy I'm mentoring right now. He's like, yeah, Steve, I just kind of feel weird being on video, and I'm just like. Well, just so you know, on a video and right now, you look the same. He's like, I just feel like an idiot. I'm like, what? You tell me you feel like an idiot all the time? You look like the way you're looking and sounding to me right now is the same you look on a video. The only difference is there's not a physical camera present. But like, if I was recording you right now, it would look the same to me as if it were looking on a video. So you're basically getting that face to face that you just, um, uh, that you wouldn't get up normally. And that's super huge to have that. So, uh, I, like I said, this is going to be a, a shorter video, but I do want to let you guys know the importance of video is huge. Um, so definitely find a way to implement it into your into your business. Uh, we do have ways to help you guys out within the Next Level Academy. If you guys are interested in learning more about that, there will be a link below this video for you. Um, other than that, I will see you guys in the next episode. Happy selling. Talk to you guys next time.